Last decade was signed by drastic changes in almost every sphere of our everyday life. The whole bunch of the high-tech solutions surround us almost everywhere, be it at home or outside. It's almost impossible now to imagine how our life would be without all these sometimes invisible interventions, allowing us to use the most prominent technologies that make our days confident, comfortable and safe. And there is a name that could be considered as a synonym of all these wonders the brand that turned the automotive world upside down by setting totally new standards and approaches to that very conservative industry. The name of the company is Tesla, which produced its first model in 2008. Although the Roadster was able to travel almost 250 miles on a single charge, with an acceleration and top speed comparable to many consumer-level sports cars, its price was too high to attract the customers. Only since 2012, when the first Tesla Model S was launched, the new era of electrification has begun. The Model S was very successful. It was awarded by several automotive and environmental publications and set new benchmarks for what an electric vehicle could be. Since then, Tesla hasn't stopped to amaze the world with its astonishing products, like mass-market Model 3 and the newly revealed Cybertruck. Moreover, according to the latest Tesla's report of the fourth quarter earnings in 2019, the electric car maker earned $7.38 billion in revenue, much more than it was expecting. The company that delivered around 112,000 vehicles in the fourth quarter of 2019 is expected to produce over 500,000 vehicles in 2020, which will be another record for the company. 2019 was a huge turning point for Tesla. Thanks to strong and always growing demand for the Model 3, Tesla has generated about $1.1 billion of free cash flow for the year. And that's why we could expect much more in the upcoming one to two years. So let's talk about new Tesla products that are on the way to hit the roads in the upcoming two years. During Tesla's Autonomy Day event in 2019, Musk announced the company's robo-taxi plan for a self-driving ride-sharing network with its electric cars. The company also aims at bringing a fleet of fully autonomous Model 3 robo-taxis to the roads without steering wheels and pedals. The timeline depends on the regulators in different jurisdictions, but the system is expected to be enabled in at least one market by the end of 2020. Actually, all new Tesla vehicles are coming to market with the full self-driving computer chip, fulfilling the hardware requirements for a high-level self-driving vehicle, and the owners will be able to add their cars to the shared fleet if they gain the full self-driving package. It's estimated a Model 3 used as a robo-taxi could generate about $30,000 in gross profit per year. Without drivers, and with improvements in the battery energy efficiency, the transportation cost will become possible to drastically decrease per mile. While actually the standard cost of ride-sharing in the US is about $2 to $3 per mile, the robo-taxi ride will cost only $0.18 cents per mile, which is 10 to 15 times less. The second awaited model for 2020 is the all-electric semi-truck, unveiled to the public in November 2017, which is going to revolutionize the whole commercial transportation system. Musk initially promised to start the production in 2019, but it was delayed until the end of 2020. But anyway, it seems all the amazing features of the semi are worth waiting so long. The Tesla's truck will be powered by four electric motors that are based on the ones that power the Model 3 and can accelerate the semi-truck from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 5 seconds without a trailer and only 20 seconds with 80,000 pounds of cargo. Actually, its performance is much above when it comes to traditional gasoline-powered trucks. One of the most important factors is the semi's cabin design also prevents it from jackknifing making it unprecedented safe on the highways and potentially rescuing thousands of motorist lives. Two variants of the truck provide drivers with 300 or 500 miles of range per charge, though Tesla is already working on the new battery technologies, so the semi-production version's range could be closer to 600 miles instead. Standard equipment assembly includes automatic emergency braking system, obstacle recognition and lane-keeping assist functions, 
as well as the forward collision warning system and the ability to communicate wirelessly with other vehicles on the road. The truck is expected to cost about $150,000 for the standard version and $200,000 for the Founders Series. A number of leading large companies have already placed pre-orders on the Semi, intending to use the new truck to reduce their carbon footprint and raise the efficiency level. Besides these new vehicles, we can expect two new versions of already selling Model S and Model X, which remain Tesla's flagship vehicles. Elon Musk has plans to bring played modes of these models to market sometime around October or November in 2020. Played is the newest and quickest mode set to roll out for the Tesla Model S. It means that an additional electric motor will be mounted on the rear axle of each car, which will provide overall better handling and acceleration. Besides, Musk has already announced that the company succeeded to significantly improve the chemistry technologies of the existing battery packs. We're rapidly approaching a 400-mile range for the Model S, so it won't be long before the Model S has a 400-mile range," he said. Other changes include wider arches and wheels with Goodyear Eagle F1 Supersport RS tires, as well as possibly carbon ceramic brakes and rear-facing jump seats. The new played versions of both the Model S and X will not only be fast on the straight line, but will also be enabled to set new records on the track. The long-awaited Model Y, a crossover built on the same platform used for the Model 3, has finally gone into production to be delivered from March 2020. The Model Y should be comparable in size with such trend-setting models like the BMW X3 and the Mercedes-Benz GLC. As Elon Musk said earlier, the Model Y should have the functionality of an SUV but ride like a sports car due to a low center of gravity and an aerodynamic drag coefficient of 0.23. The most important innovation from the production point of view is the fact Tesla is going to the aluminium casting design instead of the lot of traditional stainless steel and aluminium pieces by using approximately only one part instead of the former 70 ones. The first versions to deliver in 2020 will be the dual motor long range and performance models. With new 20 or 21 inch wheel options, both variants can achieve a range of 280 miles but thanks to engineering progress and 19-inch Gemini wheels, which are now standard for both models, the all-wheel drive Model Y can overcome a distance of 315 miles, making it the most energy-efficient electric SUV in the world. With 4.1 miles of range per kilowatt-hour, it obviously beats Ford Mach-E and the already commercialized Jaguar I-Pace. The rear-wheel drive long-range model was also originally announced but currently there's no mention of it on Tesla's website. The cheapest Model Y or the standard variant is expected to be available in 2021. Revealed in November 2019, the Tesla Cybertruck remains the most controversial and at the same time the most anticipated vehicle of Tesla's model range. With its ultra-hard stainless steel body, triangular design and almost unbreakable glasses, the Cybertruck is going to fully change the pickup truck market landscape. It will be available in three different configurations, including the single-motor rear-wheel drive model, as well as two- and three-motor models with all-wheel drive configuration. The weakest Cybertruck will go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 6.5 seconds and could reach a top speed of 110 miles per hour. The dual-motor Cybertruck is much quicker and will reportedly reach 60 miles per hour in just 4.5 seconds and develop a top speed of 120 miles per hour. And finally, the ultimate version is able to speed up from 0 to 60 miles per hour in only 2.9 seconds and reach a top speed of 130 miles per hour. One of the most interesting options available for Cybertruck buyers will be the two-person ATV, dubbed the Cyberquad. At the Cybertruck launch event, this four-wheeler scrambled up the cargo area of a Cybertruck, which became possible due to the proper work of the pickup's adaptive suspension system. Besides, Tesla provides a unique option to charge the all-electric ATV right there in the bed of the Cybertruck. 
so it would be amazing to meet this couple on the roads already in 2021. The other solution, known as ludicrous mode that's already present on Tesla's higher models, could become available for the Tesla Model 3 by the end of 2020. It is aimed to provide much faster acceleration and will enable the vehicle to reach 60 mph in less than 3 seconds. Now, the biggest battery pack available for the Model 3 has a 75 kWh capacity, but the new Model 3 might be equipped with a 100 kWh battery pack for an EPA-rated range of 400 miles per charge. Coming to the end, it's worth mentioning the second generation of Tesla's first ever model, the famous Roadster. The conceptual Roadster 2 was revealed alongside the semi-truck as a bonus to the launch event. As Elon Musk said, the new Tesla Roadster will be the fastest production car ever made, and it would obviously be due to its three motors configuration, two driving the rear wheels and one driving the front. Tesla promises a 200 kilowatts hour battery pack for the Roadster 2, which is exactly twice as much as the capacity of the actual largest pack available on any Tesla car. It will probably serve as a source for all that combo of speed, acceleration, and an unprecedented 620 mile range at highway speeds. The Roadster 2 will be able to speed up from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 1.9 seconds reach 100 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds and develop a top speed above 250 miles per hour. And that's about the base model, which, as Musk hinted earlier, is only the first step on the Roadster's performance way. And finally, let's not forget about the so-called Model 2, which is going to be the most affordable Tesla vehicle so far. There is no detailed info on this vehicle, but assumably it will come with 400 to 500 miles of range in its top spec variant. It could also have a base variant with a smaller battery pack and lower range. It may be designed in a future design and engineering center, which is going to be established in China to create an original car for worldwide consumption. So, these were the most anticipated Tesla services and products for the upcoming 12 to 18 months. Yes, right now there could be doubts on the deployment of the robo-taxi system that could face different obstacles such as unclear federal regulation of the usage of the vehicles without steering wheel and pedals. We think this issue would be arranged as soon as the demand for the self-driving rides arise. What is your vision? Would all these Tesla promises become real already this or next year? Share your thoughts and variants with us below in the comments and stay charged not to miss our next interesting videos.